afternoon, good evening everybody from wherever you are. This is Digital TV Kenya. Karibu, karibu, karibu ni sana. If this is your first time, manzae ume tune in. Manzae, welcome, welcome, welcome. Na manzae wako kama haja tune in, haja fika hapa, mulize, ako wapi, anafanya nini. Because this is the place to be. This is where manzae tunatembea kwenye mita. Ili tupate kujua ni hustle zipi ziko kwenye mita zetu. And today manzae, ukina, unafaona, this is actually thicker super highway. And I feel very amazed. As you can see, my voice is at the topest, at the topest, because manzae, I'm very much happy. I'm very humble for you tuning here. Kwa kumbusha tu, this is Hassel Mtani and this is Jicho TV Kenya. Social media pinja za kwetu, Jicho TV Kenya Facebook. Pale Instagram, tunakona kama Jicho TV Kenya. And of course, Twitter, Jicho TV Kenya. Usposa how YouTube, taka taka tufika pale Jicho TV Kenya. And don't forget to hit that subscription button. And of course, manze kumbuka kushare, share, share widely. And of course, comment pale. Tupata ku... Let's talk, let's chat pale kwenye comment session. Tuambia manze, how do you feel about this amazing, 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 amazing content? With me, your favorite guy, Rix here. And of course, pale Twitter, na kwenye kama at it's underscore Rix. Facebook, it's underscore Rix. And of course, pale Instagram here, na kwenye kama it's underscore Rix. Wacha tu... Pige, tupige gumzo pale, tuvutia newaya, tujue manze ni hustle zipi unapiga, challenges gani unapitia, and of course, ni kwa nini tu ulichagua kupiga hiyo hustle. Right about now manze, naingia mtaani, nijue ni hustle zipi hustle zinafanyika kwenye mtaa huu. Hapa hivi, hii ikiwa thika road, wacha tingi ya mtaani, usiane bali. Right guys, what about now as you can see I'm chilling with this amazing person. Na hustle yake hustle ni online card services. Asa ni pige story na hee, nisikie hii. Kazi ya cab manze ina mpelikaji. As we all know, nikisema online cab services na manisha. I'm talking of the likes of the Bolt, Uber, Safeways, Chap Chap, name them. So right about now manze, acha ni half chicha na nisikie hii online cab services na mpelikaji. Na hasua mbona tu alichagua hii. Mbona kwa ina anze kufanya kazi pali ya kuride boda. Mbona kuchukua manganya hivi, unafeel. So take a take a right about now manze, I'm gonna talk with him nisikie. Ana sema aje, bombo? Poa sana. Mbona kuita aje? Na ito Morris. Morris! E, nafanya online cab services mm -hmm. e, nafanya na Bolt na Uber Taxify Na maana so ule ama tu anze kufanya hizi online cab services mbona ukwenda ukwe anze kwa dereva pale hivyo ushike kanduthi hivi ukapeleka hivi kanduthi yeah. ule ama tu anze acha mean deal na hii Uber ama Safeway season name them Aya imekuwa poa siwezi kata for the past uh, before before hii pandemic ikuje Okay, uh, mtu wakuwa nakosa mkate okay. at the end of the day. Yeah. Na uliku unaeza ku, kulipa loans. Kama sahi hii gari kona loan. Na inafaa kulipo hiyo loan. Lakini, at the end of the day unaona, unapata do, lakini yote inaenda kwa commission. Unafa, ni kama unafanyia hizi online services kazi. Una, walipa commission yao, unafuel gari, hata maintenance ingine inakuwa shida. Ngoja 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 Maurice, ume uzungumzia kuhusu commission, ya ni yo discount. Yeah. Nataka tu nieleze kina gobaga, au eleze mtu ambaya nakuona sa hivi. Commission ina work aje, hii discount, how does it work? Na mna nyanyaswa kivipi? Aya, hii discount wanafanya hivi. Tuseme, ume request gari kutoka hapa kuenda town. Mm -hmm. Na kutoka hapa kuenda town, tuseme kwa, kwa mfano ni elfu moja. Hiyo mm -hmm. elfu moja, ukieka mafta ya miatano, Unapata wanachukua commission ya almost 25%. Iyo ni 200 to 300 shillings. Kwa hile elfu moja, uki, ukieka mafta ya miatano, wachukua commission ya miatatu, iyo ni 800. Unabaki na miambili kwa mfuko. Iyo miambili, ayeze sustain maintenance ya gari, na iko sustain uwe maisha yako, uweze kulipa bills zako, uweze kulipa nyumba, uweze kulipa maji, Watoto waende shule. Hizi zote ni challenges tunapata. Mm -hmm. Na tunaomba ama tunasema kuwa hii serikali ikatupunguzia at least bei ya mafuta. Tunaweza jisaidia kwa sababu ile pesa tunatumia kwa mafuta ndio mingi kuliko ile tunapata. Alright, wewe tatizo kubwa tu haswa ni tatizo la mafuta. Bei ya mafuta kupanda. Bei ya mafuta kupanda hiyo imetuumiza sana. Mm -hmm. eh. Right, nataka tu niambie. Hii kazi ya Uber unajua unapata unabeba watu tofauti tofauti. Watu kila aina tabia tofauti tofauti nzuri na mbaya. Hadi zingine unashtuka. Nataka tu nieleze ni kitu gani ushawahi kutana nacho ambako ambao hadi saa hii uko tu zile za wa we una feel. Nataka tu niambie tu ilikuwa na uli handle hiyo experience. Eh nimebeba mlevi siku moja. Eh hapo kwa levi haswa. Hapo kwa levi hapo. Hapo hapo kuna vituko hapo. 
Hapo kwa walevi nimebeba mlevi siku moja ana, ana mrembo wake watu wametoka dunda wako maji ikafika point wakasikia kutapika What? <laughs> Walitafika kwa gari. Wakachafua viti wakachafua. Gari huko ndani lakini eh, ilifika mahali ikabidi ni wamelipa kaosh. Unaelewa? Na kujaribu kuongea na mlevi akiwa mlevi ujaribu kumwambia ongezee pesa ya kaosh. Hiyo ni vituko zingine. Hiyo ni vita unaita. Tulienda up kwenda andi police station ndio atoe pesa ya mimi niende kaosh. Yaani hizo kidogo kidogo tu hivyo. Nilimwitisha 500 niende nioshe gari. Alikuwa anaenda distance ya 250. Alienda up kunilipa 1000 na ilikuwa tatizo sana kabla atoe hiyo pesa. Hiyo ndio naweza sema hiyo ndio kituko nimepatana nacho the last year. Na hii, hii kazi ya Uber umefanya kwa muda upi? Eh nimefanya kwa muda wa miaka 5. Yeah. Mimi nikana ngoto uba, ni watu ambao kuna gari. Unajua mtu akona gari anakuanga ameomoka. Kumbe kumbe mnanyanyaswa. Kumbe mnaisha kuna vile. Kuna vile iweza itosi. Aitoshi. Aitoshi. Mm-hmm. Lakini mwendo ni wa polepole. Right. Unapeleka siku, siku kivi yake, unaamka asubuhi unafanya kazi, jioni unaenda nyumbani unalala. Asubuhi unaamkia kazi kazi tena, unafanya. Na unaomba at the end of the month mm-hmm. utaweza kulipa bills na utaweza kujisustain. Nataka unielewa tu manze hii covid. Wajua last year kuli covid ilikuja vitu zika change. Na juzi tu our president ameka rules zingine regulations zingine ambapo manze by 8 yafuko kwa nyumba. Unachukuleje hii hatua hizi kanuni mpya ambazo our president ameweka na wewe mwenyewe pia imekuchallenge. Yaani ime ime, ime kuchallenge kivipi? Eh uh, huh. Covid tumekaa nayo last year na vile ilikuja ilikatiza vitu mingi sana ili break down life ya kila mtu na tuliweza ku move on from there na mtu akaweza kuji rebuild tena ku from the ground lakini sasa kama saa hii wamepunguza masaa ya kufanya kazi tena kwa hivyo asubuhi ukiamka saa kumi, lazima uko umeenda nyumbani by 7:30 ama saa mbili, lazima ukue kwa nyumba hiyo hiyo kafiu imepunguza masaa ya kufanya kazi na watu pay permit za kufanya kazi usiku tuendelee kufanya kazi usiku na unajua mali tuko saa hii economy inafaa kuwa 24 hours at least ndio uweze kupata kitu at the end of the day na wewe unasema hata mjapewa permit ya kufanya kazi usiku na mkipewa permit utafanya kazi gani watu wa wako sasa kuna essential services kuna madaktari wana, wanaenda kutibu watu usiku kuna ambulances kuna wagonjwa wanaenda hospitali usiku sio lazima ukue wagonjwa wa covid unaweza kuwa na mjamzito mahali anafaa kupelekwa hospitali lakini uwezi mpeleka hospitali kwa sababu mabarabara zimefungwa e, na ukifika hospitali pia unaweza shikwa na wa polisi unasaidia mtu lakini wewe utashikwa na upigwe fine upewe a heavy fine yenye uwezi lipa hiyo imekurudisha nyuma so many steps na miezi, nyuma, miezi mingi sana nyuma na hiyo naweza sema imetuadhiri sana kwa sababu atupati chenye mtu alikuwa anapata kitambo so, alright thank you Morris thank you nashukuru sana mama vipi guys manze it's been a, it's been really it's been amazing with Morris napenda vile ambavyo ameongea na amesema kitu important sana kwenda pole pole. Yaani unajua leo itakuwa hivi kesho unapoamka manze una hope for better and better and better always. That's why we always say manze the sun will rise and we will try and try and try again. This is your TV and of course this is Hustle Mtani with me your favorite girl Rix. Kumbuka tu pale vosho social media pages za kwetu tutakwenda kama Jicho TV Kenya Facebook, Instagram Jicho TV Kenya na pale Twitter tunakwenda kama pia Jicho TV Kenya. And of course YouTube manze take take tu yani mbio mbio as as if kama ni YouTube ya kwetu Jicho TV Kenya na usahau kugonga hiyo subscription button and of course remember to like, share and manze una comment, una comment, una comment. Yaani tunapiga gumzo pale hivyo kwenye comment section. Ana na mtu mwanza mimi mwenyewe na kwenda kama @tanaskorix Twitter, Facebook na Instagram tunaweza endelea kupiga gumzo pale hivyo tunavutiana waya tujue ni hasa gani next tunakuja kuficha hapa hivi kwenye Jicho TV Kenya don't get anywhere Mambo vipi? Poa sana. Takuna juzi tu anakuitaje wewe mkazo wa wapi na ni hasa lipi unapiga? Oh mimi naitwa Peter mtaji mzee wa kawe ndani. Eh
ni kusimamia kinyozi na mpesa kinyozi na mpesa nasimamia changamoto kuu unapitia sasa hivi kwa hii kinyozi ni gani considering the fact that kuna covid 19 na wajaiden usijua jaiden wetu aliyeka amesha zingine alitilia mkazo amesha zingine hivi majuzi sasa hii challenge mingi ni ya covid 19 kazi imekuwa ngumu hii masaa kapi pia imetuharibia biashara sana kwa hii customers wetu huwa tunanyoa tuna extend mpaka saa tatu lakini saa hii kapi tena imekuja kazi imekuwa ngumu kulingana na situation ambayo tuko covid 19 period unajua kwa hivyo inabidi utilie measures kuwa na measures ambazo wewe na staff wako mtakuwa mnajikinga na covid 19 unapoangalia hii kazi ambayo unafanya unagusa watu wengi sana watu tofauti tofauti na the level of the it's, it's high kuna high risk ya ku spread hii covid 19 taka pia utujuze tu ni vipi unasaidia unajikinga wewe mwenyewe na, na staff wako na pia clients wako na hii covid 19 kwanza sisi tunatilia hiyo manani sana kwanza customer kingia pale nje ama mtu yote anaingia kwa hii duka lazima anae mkono pale nje pale kuna machi akiingia ndani asandidi kuna sanitizer pale na bila maski hata ingia kani kujembesa mpaka kwenda maski na mimi mwenyewe niko na hapo staff ile aweza wanaandol customer wakiwa wamefaa maski unyo hii kazi yako una 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 contact hakuna social distance contact Unagusa watu kwa sana. Nataka uniambie hii social distance unacheza nayo vipi social distance? Kwa sasa hii kusema tu kweli watu sio wengi kwa kitambo. Mtu anakuja kinyozi mocha moja. Eh, sasa hapo at least tuna maintain hiyo social distance. Eh. Unaposema watu sio wengi kama kitambo fanua tu tafadhali. Yaani kusema kweli hakuna kasi. Eh, kitambo tulikuwa tunanyoa kutoka watu hamsini lakini sasa hii sio machavu tunaweza nyoa hata watu tano kwa siku unaanisha kwani watu wameenda wapi langu watu nika wanaokopa kukuja kunyolewa eh si wanasema yadi hiyo contact eh hawataki contact hawataki contact kuna kijana sasa hivi anakuona anakutazama kijana mdogo tu rika yako hivi youth mwenzako amekaa pale nyumbani ametulia anasema hakuna kazi unajua na maybe anatarajia mzazi am support mtu amsaidie pale unaweza mpa maida gani Niko nije inasema akuje tu atafute kazi atakani kunyoa kazi ya kinyozi iko na pesa eh asiatiwa asimtarau kazi ya kinyozi ama nini eh kazi ya kinyozi iko na pesa Mimi nasema kazi ya kinyozi ina pesa kumaanisha yafani nani nilikuwa nimesomea kwa sababu mimi naona unashika tu machine unanyoa mtu pale unapeleka hivi unanyoa unafata kadogo naweza kwa ni kuna skill ambayo inahitajika ya mtu anyoe hii kazi ya kinyozi lazima mtu usomee lakini kuna ile mtu anakuanga talented lakini 90% ni mpaka uende shule eh wewe mwenyewe unajua kunyoa najua umeenda shule ukasomea kunyoa eh kwa tu mtaani mtaani huku huku kujifunza 1 2 3 alinijifunza kidogo eh right nataka big story kuna watu ukiangalia pia watu wengi hawavai face mask yani wanachukulia hii covid 19 imekuwa iko haijatupata hatuja kuwa wagonjwa wana ignore yani ignorance is too much piga story pia nao anaambia tu si hii ugonjwa iko watumie tu wafaizi hiyo face mask kani kuna mkono wasichoke eh wasichoke that's the one eh waendelee tu eh umesikia about covid vaccine nimesikia mimi wewe mwenyewe kama pita unaweza toka hapa uende kwa hizo hospitali ambazo kuna covid vaccine ukapiga hiyo chanjo hadi kipata wakati ndaenda mimi mwenyewe ni chanjo mbona kwanza hujaenda kupata hiyo chanjo hii nishapata nafasi unapata nafasi ushasema kuwa hakuna watu kumaanisha una una nafasi mbona hujatumia nafasi kwenda ukapata chanjo sasa na ngoja sasa walikuwa wanasema kwanza wanaanzia madaktari oh sasa wakikuja kwa common man hata mimi naenda kupata chanjo Right right thank you thank you thank you so much Peter. All right mambo vipi how are you doing i can see manza nimetulia nimechill kwa this amazing beautiful manza kinyozi and one of the things i like i really like about vinyozi and men inside here is that they always look neat like ngale wanza hii kichwa hii kichwa ni safi and uh, unapotuangalia unapotazama those men who keep their hair short clean they always look attractive they always look amazing and right about now i'm chilling with this amazing person nataka tuambie tu anaitwa nani na haswa anafanya nini hapa mambo salama sana wanakuitaje naitwa martin chage 
Matimu wafanya nini hapa? Nimekuja hapa juu this is the best kinyozi ambao unapata services za kunyolewa mm -hmm. and everything nice that comes from here. Oh, una, 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 una unapenda services hapa. Massage ama nini? <laughs> Mwanzo wanasema wanaume wengi wanakuja kinyozi kwa sababu ya masaji. <laughs> Lakini tangu nilianza kunyolewa hapa mwaka wa 2014. Wacha uongo 2014? Yes. That's been six, six years down the line. True. Eh, hey, huyu huyu ni loyal. Huyu ni huyu ni loyal. Huyu ni loyal client. Unafaa kuwa unanyoa free. Unanyonga free sometimes. <laughs> Kuna sometimes wanalipatia anga discount like mara mbili kwa za Shevia like uh, three times in a week. Wewe ngoja. Wewe hizi nyolezo wapi unaniongelea kwanza una Shev? <laughs> kichwa kichwa 3 times a week na ndevu mara moja moja alright yes hey, hey. so nikuja like 3 times a week eh? mm -hmm. utaona mdosi amesema macho asilipe hapa mm -hmm. like this sunday mm -hmm. asilipe wewe 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 unakuja kunywa 3 times ama anakuja kudandia wifi tuambie tu ni nini uh, unakuletanga hapa ama ni wifi ni services zao mm -hmm. na pia wifi na tu fresha sana mm -hmm. although haikuja mape, uh, kitambo sana mm -hmm. It is has been a very great customer service. Quite to see you tuna fryer. Leo umekuja kunyoma ni wifi imekuwa. Well, Juu niko na a place I want to go on Wednesday. Alright. So lazima nikuje leo nionge na mtu wangu anipige shave vizuri. Yes. Alright. Naka tunijuze tu kuna corona sasa hivi. Na umevalia face mask. Kiko sawa? Lakini unapokuja hapo kinyozi utagusa na mtu. Huo mtu unajua amenyoa tu wangapi before nimeshazgania na chukua yeye mwenyewe kujikinga na virusi vikali vya COVID-19. Lakini mwenyewe utakuja unamwamini sana utakuja umnyoe. Do you think manze kuna vile unajirisikia health yako ama? Ah, uh, what happens eh? Kitambo haiko na hii mambo ya COVID-19. Ungekuja anaosha mashine yake, anaka pale kwa Sterilizer mm -hmm. anafanya vitu zake mm -hmm. alafu anapaka spirit mm -hmm. ana brush kidogo and that was that mm -hmm. but squeeze vile nimeona mm -hmm. wame improve sana okay juu unaona mashini na ka masaa mengi zaidi mm -hmm. kwa sterilizer unaweza pata ile mashini aliyo nayo saa nane mm -hmm. saa ndio inaitwa kwa sterilizer alafu pia yeye mwenyewe binafsi mm -hmm. anafanya shughuli yake ya kuosha mkono mm -hmm ku sanitize na kila kitu so i feel safe here you are you are, you are very safe yes i feel safe here nataka upige gumzo na kijana pale ambaye anakutazama sasa hivi watu wengi wana ignore sana the fact that kuna covid 19 na sasa hizi kuna third wave that's why kajiado sisi nairobi kiambu machakos county nakuru we, we are in a lockdown yes sir nataka upige gumzo na kijana nakwambia uhunye our jaden jaden ametilia ame mkazo unajua ndio mta jaden jaden ametilia mkazo lakini there are some people out here who are ignoring piga mm. gumzo na waambie manzee corona iko wa stay safe wa social distance na everything uh, asante sana mm -hmm. now what i would like to say covid iko mm -hmm. and it is here with us mm -hmm. kitambo tukisoma hizo report na minister of health eh? alikuwa anasema tu numbers mm -hmm. that is ya tujui mm -hmm. but mali imefika saa hizi akisoma those numbers mm -hmm. It is a person you know or a person who knows someone. That's how serious it mekua. Mm -hmm. So ningeomba tu tukae safe kabisa, u sanitize, wear mask yako, u keep social distancing and uh, nikoshua Mungu atatusaidia tusail through hii shit yote. Nikoshua, eh. ukoshua. Nikoshua because I pray also about it. So Wa Wewe mungu sio yako pray tuguzie church kidogo tufike pale kanisani chacha zimefungwa na wewe unasema unaomba unajua kila mnajua kila mtu anaomba akiwa pale nyumbani kwake lakini kanisa pia zimefungwa nataka tu sema ka kitu una filaje ah na feel vibaya sana because sasa you know when you convert in a church it brings even more fulfilling feeling kwa heart yako but what i can say It is okay vile government imeona hii covid inatupiga vibaya sana eh mm -hmm. wali meet those big gatherings mm -hmm. but kindly wherever you are mm -hmm. uh, on that sunday just imagine it's on a normal sunday mm -hmm. piga dua yako piga mombi yako tuombe ombe inchi ndio hiyo gonjo yote iende kama imeisha right thank yes. you thank you thank you thank you so much everybody man this is hustle mtani of course ndani ya Dicho TV Kenya kumbuka social media pages za kwetu tunakwenda kama Dicho TV Kenya Facebook Instagram Dicho TV Kenya and of course pale Twitter tunakwenda kama Dicho TV Kenya taka taka tu ufika pale YouTube ya kwetu Dicho TV Kenya and of course yeah, of course kumbuka manzee ku hit that subscription button and remember to share share widely and of course 
like piga like pale comment yani tupate ku interact pale tukua na ka interaction interaction section wewe mwanze nimekula mandizi anyway don't worry about that at its underscore x to your facebook na instagram ndivyo na kwenda mie naweza fika pale hata ukiona tao by the way unaweza ni follow tupige gumzo pale hivyo this hustle mtani kwa kumbusha tu tunatembelea kwenye mita tujue ni hustle zipi zinaelea kwa mita hizi zinapigwa na nani kwa nini kuanzia lini and of course wanajikinga wana vipi na virusi vikali vya covid 19 Hey yeah, Manze, it's been real. It's been amazing, my beautiful, amazing, amazing people. Thank you, Manze, for staying with me till the end of this hustle Tani show. Until next time, we're gonna meet here at this same, same place, and of course, maybe the same time and different, different places, featuring different, amazing hustle. Now, guys, before I leave, any before ni talk, before ni sepe, before ni ngemi tini. Ntaka gongo yao subscription button. Manze, kama ya fanya ivo do that right, right, right about now because. Time is also not our side because I've been a safe as I've been. Kumbuka kutupata pale social media pages za kwetu Jicho TV Kenya Facebook, Instagram Jicho TV Kenya and of course Twitter tunakwenda pia kama Jicho TV Kenya. Until next time, God bless you.